Hey, what is up, folks, and welcome back to another episode of the Theta SMP. Welcome back. Went on a little few day break, and that is because last week was Theta Marathon. We did a huge, almost every single day. I think we uploaded five episodes last week. Uh, I don't know. We had, what, 19, and then now we have 26, so. Was it six episodes? I don't know. I gotta go back and check, but we uploaded a lot of Theta. So I needed a little break, I needed a little retreat. Ooh, there's a floating block up there. I'm gonna go, I'm gonna go fix that. But we got some stuff to work on today because I think we, did we get some stuff done here? Uh, Garden with DJ at Spawn, that's not done yet. Town Hall, I think that's pretty much, uh, that's pretty much done. Our house, PvP Arena, I'm not sure we're doing that this time around. I think... We're going to wait for next season. That's a conversation for a different day. Uh, also this. Uh, I don't think we're going to do that this season. Because uh, a little bit of talking I got to do now. I don't want to spoil anything because I don't really know what uh, I plan. I, I don't know what people, what the members of this server are going to say to me if I say anything. But let's just say that um, we got a little plan coming for, uh, you know, Theta members. Oh yeah, this. Um, this if you hadn't, can't even tell already. This I compl I cleared out. This was a I think this was all hill here uh, all around. I flattened it. It's all flat. Getting text messages every day because I'm popular. J K. But yeah, this is this is kind of what we got going here. Uh, it wasn't much. It was just a little hill here. I think I'm still gonna clean some out over this way. And see how that goes. Look at that beautiful sun going down. Where are my clouds? Fast, fancy. Why am I going right there? Boop. I don't know if I like that. It's good on the building map, but it's not good here. That's about perfect. I don't like them too low to the ground. So, yeah, anyway, guys, you want a little break, just a week break. I don't know when this episode is going to go out, honestly, but we did do a few things. Uh, last thing we did, what, was was fight the dragon? The Durgan? Yeah, we fought the Durgan, but um, I hear baby zombie. He didn't hear any. No, he's not. I don't know where he is. Right here. He's somewhere. I hope he's not wearing armor. This is our beacon. We fought the dragon last episode, which was a, a fun, it was a fun episode. Very, very fun. What, oh, that was that. Okay. Fun episode. We fought the dragon. Also, um, might show, I, I did record, but I don't think I'm going to show the whole thing. We did explore the end afterward. <laughs> And that was very fun. That was a fun experience. And uh, I unfortunately didn't receive anything. I, I died on my way out. The Enderman ganged up on me, man. It was like a thousand to one. I just realized, what is my computer sound at? I hope it's not too high. What are my Minecraft sounds at? I'm going to go down just a little bit just to be safe. So what did I wanted to do today is I wanted to get us going a little bit on our personal house. I've started designing it in a different world, in my in my creative test world. Come here, Mr. Skeleton, you get wrecked, you stupid. I started designing it in my creative test world. And uh, this should be enough space. It's a quite a large building. It's, uh, I was working on the design, trying to get the coloring going because it was... You know, it was difficult. Uh, I have so many of these helmets. So there was a thunderstorm uh, before I started recording not that long ago. I watched Steven Universe 
tonight uh, while I was on the server because I like that show. It's a great show. 10 out of 10. If you think you're too old for cartoons, you're lame, boys, because Steven Universe is a great, great show. But a jolly good show, sir. <laughs> uh, so, bef well, anyway, I was there was a thunderstorm. I swear, every two minutes, there was... There was a stupid lightning next to me, and it would make the the skeleton horses, the the horses, the skull, the skull, skeleton horse of, with uh, the helmets on. And because I have looting, I killed like I literally. There were about seven different groups. They spawned just all over the place, and I was just running around killing them to get levels. So in the process, I got like a bunch of their helmets because they dropped the. The iron helmets. They all spawn with I these iron helmets with similar enchants. And hello, get wrecked, stupid. There we go. Thank you. Game's a little laggy today. I don't know what it is. I feel like it might just be the world being kind of stupid. But uh, I think we're okay. Let's do a quick refresh. There we go. Hi. Hello. I know one of you see me. Haha. -ha. Get wrecked, you stupid. I say that a lot, don't I? I need to think of some more things to say. But yeah, I wanted to, to work a little bit today on the design for our house. So, actually, oh, this is almost done. Good, 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 good. I'm smelting up some chisel stone brick. Uh, do I need these? I guess I'll keep them. Yeah, you see, I got a few of these helmets. I'll probably just wear them. My diamond helmet broke uh, somewhere, probably in the end. I uh, got some arrows, got some bones. Very good, very good. I think I'm going to meet you guys over in my creative test world. And we're going to look at kind of the things I built. I really did bring out a huge amount of the design in the creative test world. I want to see how much the axe does. Three. My sword does a lot more. Well, I don't have any sharpness on this, but... Yeah, I'm going to go meet you guys over in the creative test world now. Alright, guys. Welcome to the creative test world. Not much on here. As you guys remember, I had the computer issue. Therefore, I lost my original creative test world, which had everything on it. It had so much stuff on it. You don't even know. So much stuff on it. But yeah, I was on here figuring out some stiff to, uh, you guys might recognize a few of these. You can recognize this house right here. Uh, here's some other stuff. Uh, some of the stuff you might see on here might end up as a let's build at some point. I don't know, maybe. But yeah, here, you just got some random stuff. But what we're thinking about, what I'm talking about is right here. Ooh, great great stuff 10 out of 10 so yeah here we go this is this is kind of what i was thinking about this is going to come over i think another another bit here i'm, I'm working on size right now because i don't know exactly how large i want to make this thing but it's obvious that dark dark oak wood is going to be a very paramount resource in this uh in the construction of this build because I'm using a lot of dark oak logs, and I think I'm using some of the planks too. Yeah, I'm using some for the supports here, which I think I also want to change up the design. I know I'm kind of throwing a lot out you at a lot at you right off the bat, but I'm trying to figure out what'll be better. Was it that? I don't think that's better. I think this. I think the other one is better. Do I have slabs? There we go, yes. Yeah, it's not often that you guys get to just kind of see me build randomly in creative mode. Because if I do this, first of all, first of all, if I do that, would that be better? Or that maybe? And if I do that, if I do that, it's unique. And then if I do something like that, oh, that's really out there. I think I like our original better. Because we have a log right here. We just put a log right there. Uh, maybe that. That's not bad. That's not bad at all, actually. Hold on. Let's see. It's it's just like this, except this is upside down. That's not the great. You know, that's not that bad. It adds a little bit more structure, I think. 
Let's let's check that out. Let's build with with Liam Brockman on free SMP. Uh, whether we're gonna start this on the actual server today, you can kind of see I got a little little bit of taste of kind of every part of the build. Uh, the size is this is what I was working out. This whole side here, I don't I don't know what I'm gonna do. I have this whole curved side here. It does look a little bit like what we had on Block Kingdom, except it's it's only it it's technically three floors. Like this is an attic floor right here where this will be, and what this will do is this is going to come up like that. Maybe, maybe just like that. I don't know. Maybe. Let's try a few things. I mean, obviously, this is the rim that we have for everything here. So this will come up like this. And then... Do we have just a slab? Do you want to just use a slab? It's probably the best solution right there. And then, behind, we have just this. Do we put wood on top? I think we put wood on top. We need spruce. And that roof will go up into that. Yeah, that'll add a, a new layer. I don't do that very often. I don't add these little sections on top. Uh, there will probably be one for each area here. Like, there'll be one right here, one right here, one right here, and then maybe probably one over here, too. And I think that'll be a good... I'm also replacing the brick. You see brick inside here, right? Well, I'm going to replace that with these clay. Now, it's not the best clay color in the world but uh let's let's actually change all of them up here for a second and i think i i decided i don't i didn't like this did i decide that did i ever want to change that back i don't know i don't know actually now that i i don't know like what if i did that that just looks really random. Okay, let's... I don't want to spam blocks. I don't want to, like, do a spam blocky kind of build. Because I want to keep this sort of... Normal. So let's just see what we can do here with... With just some... Normal blocks. Do I got a glass pane? Uh, pane. There we go. like using my... like using the black. Alright. Add a little bit of darkness through there. Now let's go back over and take a look at that on like multiple structures. And I know we changed. You know, I think I just made the decision that I think three high windows are going to do us really well in this build because we're already going to have really high ceilings. The floor level on this floor is going to be right here. Like say that's the floor for this level. That's going to be right here. The floor level for this level is going to be way down here. So we are talking and we're going to do a lot of cool interior stuff by the way, but we're talking roughly uh, two, four, six and a half, six and a half blocks, which is, which is 18, no, 19 and a half feet, or, yeah, this is a 19 and a half foot high ceiling, because that's six, let me think, the blocks are measured in meters, so three, six, 9, 12, 15, 19 and a half. Am I wrong on that? 19 and a half? Am I correct? I think so. All that together will be 19 and a half. Okay, any, anyway, not, not a math person, by the way. 
now if I put blocks along here, and say I close this off, is there a lighting lighting bug that comes with that? No, there's not. Ooh, you know what we can do then? When we make the ceiling here, we can put lo uh, logs across. It'll add a little bit more structure, and it'll it won't make the ceiling seem so high because this is a really high like this is like you're walking through and you're looking up and that is very high could do lights too that actually that's not a bad idea either could lower the ceiling to about okay now i'm thinking of ceiling designs i know i'm, I'm like i said i'm literally rambling on because i wanted to do this with you guys on camera here because i really have a cool design for what i think we can do so say we put the ceiling design right i mean put the ceiling right here that gives us that this will be the ceiling from our lower view. In between that, we could do something like this. And now this is just thinking outside the box here. Uh, land. No, lamp. Yeah, there we go. Good old, good old redstone lamp. Go right there. I've never been a fan of the redstone lamps, but I think this will be a good opportunity to try and start using them. Maybe. I don't know. Now I could do this. This is very much an option. Do it to the side. And have a little bit of space there. So when I do... So you, that means we'd have this, as a if it, if it was flat, which also means we can do. If I can try to do it here, something like this. Trying to very lightly do it. It's becoming nighttime. That's okay. I had commands set in the old world that you know changed it, but uh, this. Yeah, I feel like that would ruin it if I did that. At that point, I just might as well do glowstone if I was going to do something like that. And I don't think I'd have the stairs either. Could do that. I don't know. I, I was thinking previously a fence. I know this is the wrong color fence. Oh, that doesn't even connect. Okay. Uh, What is a good block that can kind of just go fit right in there and be a good cover for the lamp? Now, I guess I, I shouldn't forget, I have these, too. These are interesting. These are very interesting, the way these work. They admit light. I don't know how much. It might be about as much as a torch, if I were to guess. Let's go through our blocks here. And let's see, because we're thinking of light designs. I know I'm all over the place with this. I just want to spend a, min a hot minute on working this ceiling design or light design. Trapdoor might not be a good idea. Maybe the lantern's just the overall better idea. Our video is going to come to an end here in a second. Hmm. Yeah, I don't know. Does light shine through hoppers? Yes, it does. Does that look stupid, though? It looks like, like, where's the light coming from? <laughs> that might look a little stupid. Hold on, let's try, to, let's try to figure this out. I know we can figure this out. We just got to try to figure it out. I know it shines through a daylight sensor. That's not bad. Doing something like that. And then putting a trap door on it, maybe? Tap. Trap. There we go. It's kind of different. That's something we can work out when we actually work on the roof. Because we'll have a lot... Look how much space we'll have. Because we could even do, like, a light switch if we wanted to. Because that's how much room we have. But let's take a quick look. Time, set, day. Let's make that t day for a second. Uh, you might be able to tell wonder you might be wondering what this is. This is a tower 
that I think I'm going to put on top of there. I want to pack a bunch of stuff onto this house. I want it to be kind of busy, but not with just like block placing. I mean like busy in the case that I want a water wheel inside here. Maybe in the front, honestly. Hmm. I don't know. I think like a stream in front. Yeah, water wheel on the side I think will do us a little better. But yeah, that that look cool. Have a water wheel on the side. I want to have a tower on top. Maybe a bell tower with a flag. Or maybe just a tower with a flag. Be kind of tall. Like say say it goes to about this high. Where are we sitting at right now? Round that up to about 90. 90 blocks. Well, what is this? That's 64. So we got about... This house will be about 26 blocks tall. Did I do my math right there? I think I did. Yeah, 26 blocks tall. Which is, I think, pretty tall. I mean, that's enough to kill you if you aren't wearing anything. <laughs> uh, yeah, so th th ignore all this. This was actually the original design I was working on. Uh, I was watching a lot of Corrales trying to figure out if I wanted to do, if I still wanted to do a traditional house, and I kind of just abandoned it and went back to like, okay, you know what? We're just gonna do a, we're just gonna do a regular old traditional, uh, not traditional, a good old medieval, medieval home. That looks kind of cool. I like that. But yeah, guys, I think this video is pretty much done i think we're good here i'm sorry i didn't really spend any time on theta i know i kind of came on here and was like hey let's do a little bit of building here but this is sort of the design i'm working on i might even port this over completely and just work on this i need to figure out how i want to do this design uh because i have glass panes in my inventory which i do i think i want to do just a big glass like a bunch of glass windows and stuff like that Maybe have the entrance right here. I think this would be a good spot for an entrance. Uh, big grand entrance that looks something like this. This is set up perfectly for that. Something that looks kind of like that. It'll look a little church-like, but that's okay. That's okay. It'll be okay. You know what? That'll be fine. But yeah, I, we'll work on this more. I think we're going to actually work on this in Theta next episode. So, what I'm going to do... I'm going to end this episode here, and I would like to thank you guys so much for watching. If you guys enjoyed, be sure to like, subscribe, comment, do all the wonderful things. I'll see you guys later. Once again, thank you guys so much for watching.